I'm out here coming to get some revenge on a fish I think might have been the biggest fish I've ever hooked into a few days ago. I'm coming for you. We'll see what happens. All right. We're out here today fishing a 10 inch lizard. And what I like to do is give it a good cast out there and I let it sit down. Give it a second. And then I just kind of raise up real slow once or twice, but don't raise it up too high because if something grabs it, you need to be in the strike zone and be able to set that hook up. And then what I do is I dry, I just reel down the slack and then I just keep doing the same thing just with the wrist, just slowly kind of bouncing it up and down. Basically, you know, you're dragging it and bouncing it off the bottom real slowly. And that's what I'm doing. I'm just going to work it real slow. It's almost like finesse fishing. This is how I like to work these uh, lizards here. A lot different from uh, most of the other baits. And basically, like I say, it's all in the wrist here. I hooked on to the biggest fish, I think, in my life over here. It had flew up out of water. This is a few days ago and uh, went and took me into the pads and these fish are smart man it took me up in them pads and and wrapped me all around there so i'm back here today to get revenge so we'll see what happens here It's a beautiful morning out. Well, we just got one out here. Uh, it's not the one that I was uh, looking for. Got it on a 10 inch lizard. Nice little two and a half pounder here. I'm gonna let her go. Let her do its thing. 10 inch lizard getting the job done. We out here doing what we always do. Uh, think about these baits right here. Uh, number one, nobody has these. This is our plastic. Uh, it's custom made. The plastic is ours. This lizard, I've caught five or six fish on. It's still good. Uh, we add a, a special flavor so when they bite it, they go down and nail it. And then because the outside, we add a scent. It's not just the baits. It's the magic. Get with the Gay Hook Magic Baits, folks.